Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Travis P11. Got another video for you. Today, just a quick one about something I did to my Jeep Cherokee. Well, actually, I did this about two years ago and I wanted to talk about it in a video to let you know what I just recently did. A uh, quick story for you. April 2014, uh, Central Nebraska got hit by some pretty nasty hail, some uh, you know bad tornado activity and so on. My vehicle was out in the parking lot uh, at, at my location where I, where I work and it got hailed on, all right? So I took it to the body shop the next day. They said it was gonna be about $25 to $2,700 for paintless debt removal. You know, I got a few dings in the hood. Uh, the top, you know, the paint was already shot. It was already cracking. It was already starting to just kind of wear through to the primer. So my buddy and I took the roof rack off. We sanded it, we painted it, and I ran up to uh, my local Harbor Freight the following weekend and picked up some roll-on bed liner, basically rhino lining, I guess a lot of people like to call it. This is the Harbor Freight brand. Uh, we sanded down the roof, we masked off the areas that we wanted to roll it on, uh, we primered the roof, let it dry, and did two coats. Well, that was about two years ago, and it's held up fairly well, and it's a very, very rough, durable finish uh, when it dries. Um, I just recently rolled this stuff on about two hours ago, and I just wanted to show you what it looks like. And, uh, you know, you want to put a coat on. Uh, what I did a lot two years ago is let it sit for 24 hours, and then I put another coat on, and it turned out looking really good. Um, you know, it's very durable. You can throw wood up here. You can throw rebar. You can throw stuff you buy at Sam's Club. Man, whatever you want. You're not going to mess it up. Uh, so anyway, for about 50 bucks, and then the price of my rollers and some masking tape, um, I was able to fix the roof on my vehicle. I have a lot of people that give me some compliments on it. They say that it looks like it's, you know, they, they wonder if it was done at the factory like that or... If I had it done by some aftermarket company, uh, no, just did it myself one afternoon. So today, put the fresh coats on and it's all good to go. Um, about that, you know, I, my roof had a few little rust spots on it and I noticed that the rust was kind of starting to uh, wear through. And so that's why I decided to put one coat on today and just call it good. But uh, otherwise, I think that's about it. So, you know, about two years down the road and it's still holding in there. So anyway, this is Travis P11, just showing you a quick fix for... Anybody that's got a vehicle that you don't mind uh, kind of modifying the roof a little bit, messing things up a little bit, but making it a little more durable. So there you go. Have a great day and be safe.